He's out there operating without any decent restraint, totally beyond the pale of any acceptable human conduct. Uh, Luke, would you play that tape with the captain, please? Yes, sir. I'm sorry. Listen to this carefully, Captain. a good friend of mine, actually a family friend. I consider him a friend, but he wasn't really a close friend of mine, but he was a very close friend of my family. And it was a gentleman by the name of Wilton. And he was talking to me about men of authority. And he went back telling a story about when he was in Vietnam. And he was a first sergeant of a platoon. And their previous second lieutenant who ran the platoon had died a few days before in a firefight who hadn't given the best of orders. And they assigned a new lieutenant and they told Wilton who he was because he was the first sergeant. He ran the platoon essentially for the second lieutenant. And he was in charge of looking after the men. And this second lieutenant had graduated from college, which back then was a bigger deal than it is today. He was educated, had gone to the, then the war college and was a second lieutenant. And when he got there, he told Wilton that 0600 in the morning, we are going to be storming this hill over here. Wilton looked at it and told him, that's a bad idea. We're going to lose at least a minimum of, of half of the platoon if we do that. I don't think it's a good idea, sir. And he told him, well, I'm in charge and we will damn well storm that hill in the morning. Wilton told him, yes, sir. And I asked Wilton, what did you do? And he said, I had to stop and think about it, and I had to weigh out if I was going to let this man of authority give a bad order that was going to kill off all of those men that I had to look after. And he said, and I did the only thing that could be done. So when he was taking a shit in a latrine, I rolled a grenade under the door and walked off. And he said, if that's how you deal with a man of authority who is giving you that. It was brilliant. It was outstanding in every way. And he was a good man, too. A humanitarian man. But out there with these natives, it must be a temptation to be God. Infiltrate his team by <clears throat> whatever means available and terminate the command. Terminate. Terminate with extreme prejudice.